Honestly, I don't give a f about Michael Myers. Some say I'm the hero, and others say I provoked him. So you've been working with a horror icon, surely swapping stories and making memories behind the scenes. But what is one lesson that you learned from Michael Myers? Oh my gosh, a lesson that I've learned from Michael Myers. I mean, well, you, you gotta give it to him. He's very uh, tenacious. <laughs> he doesn't give up. Who's the horror icon? Michael Myers. No matter how fast you run, he can walk faster. <laughs> That's really good. This time, something feels different. He's more dangerous. Is he not? Is he not a horror icon? I know you are, of course. I don't even consider him on any level whatsoever. He, he doesn't exist as far as I'm concerned. For a character like Michael, it's really challenging as a writer because there is no dialogue, there's no expression, there's no emotion, there's no motivation. So what I've learned from him is almost like it's light and dark, and I mean that in the literal sense. You see it on your sweater, like the darkness on one half and the light, like the less you see of him, sometimes the more you fear him. The suggestion of a, of a humanistic facial feature uh, lost in the shadow is such a, a wonderful thing to be able to play with light. So one thing he's taught me about is sometimes less is more. Man, I don't know. I don't know what I learned from Michael. Fear? It's scary. It's really scary on set when he walks in a room. It's scary. Is it still shocking when you see the actor behind the scenes? Hundred percent. It's also it's more jarring probably. Yeah. It's in also James movie. takes it so seriously. He's so in it. Does he break out of that when he's out of the the uniform, or does he just kind of stay in it? I would say when he's out of the uniform, yes. Mm -hmm. But when he's in the jumpsuit and the mask is like in his vicinity. No. Also some of the prosthetics that Chris, Chris Nelson yeah. has some prosthetics yeah, on his yeah. face. And when he's in that, he'll just sit there and meditate. And it's so creepy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I take it really seriously. I think the only way Laurie Strode can have integrity is if I have integrity about it. So I am Laurie Strode. So Michael Myers is a killer. And, I, and honestly, I don't give a f about Michael Myers. Like, I don't care about Michael Myers. It's like Voldemort, you know, he who shall not be named. I don't, like, it's not even a question I can answer because to answer it removes Lori and I am Lori. Come and get me, mother.